Hello everybody, this is Jen from Ain and Suds and Such. And tonight I am making a new soap. Seems like that's all I do anymore is make new soaps. Which I will be making new soap for quite a while because I'm getting ready to do my fall and winter line. But this is not. I am soaping tonight to a fragrance called Daisy Dream Girl. It's the new fragrance from uh, Bath and Body Works. So we will see how that goes. This is my coil oatmeal and my can and clay. Get that buzzed in. I'm going to do four colors uh, for the daisy part I'm doing yellow and orange and the base is going to be like off-white and then I want to add blue you know, for like the dream part of the soap. So, we'll see. Okay. Add my lye water. And my lye water does have Tessa Silk in it. Let's get that strained. a new fragrance so I have no idea how it's going to behave so I may split my colors off first and then add the fragrance to it and of course I'm soaping probably around 80 85 degrees Get our three colors here. You can't see what I'm doing. drop our fragrance and yeah okay let's get our white in creamy color. I don't strive for white white because every time I do um, I end up with uh, the separation from the titanium dioxide so I try not to push it. Okay let's get our blue. I didn't want it really, really dark. It's good. And I may do an 
in the pot swirl with the blue and the off-white. I'm not sure. Hit our orange. We'll have the glitter on the top. Now we have yellow. to behaving beautifully. Let's get my colorants out of the way. Yeah, still really, really nice. Okay. I think I will do the in the pot swirl with these two colors. And then pour that in and then do the drop swirl with the other two. I'm awfully quiet tonight, I don't know. I'm sorry. It's because the kids are sleeping. Yeah, it's starting to thicken up just a hair. Not much. Okay. Let's get this pour done. My sister actually gave me the idea um, for this. For the colors. I always decide what kind of design I'm going to do and I decide it when I make it. I don't never plan it ahead. So if you guys ever order soap from me and one time you may get a certain swirl in a soap and a different time by the same fragrance and it looks different. That's just because I'm unpredictable. 
I like to just soap and enjoy it. All right, let's get this one poured in. Switch. It's so weird, I'm left-handed, but I do so much stuff right-handed. Just like normally I pour um, my colors and everything right-handed, but I know you guys can't see it if I do it like that. So I switch to my left hand and then that's why I have to switch back again to clean my bowls out. Alright. I think I'm going to let this one sit up just a minute because I don't think it's ready to texture. And I want to texture the top and then put glitter. Yeah, no, it's not ready. So, I will pause you guys and come back when it is ready. Okay, I am back. I haven't tested it to see if it's ready, but I think it is. I cleaned up everything, but I've only been gone like five minutes. I put everything in the sink and rinsed it. So, but I think it's ready. Yeah, perfect. Now, of course, you guys know I did not go back in and do any swirls with the colors that I dropped in. And that is because I do not want to mess up my in the pot swirl that I did. I'm afraid if I go back in and do more that it will cause them to mix too much. My head's probably all up in the way. Sorry. Excited to cut this one. It smells really, really good. Mm -hmm. I guess that looks good. I could play with the top of my soap all day. Okay, let's get our glitter. color combination. It's really pretty. Um, and of course you know the yellow and orange is for the daisy part and I was thinking you know just yellow and orange and white. I didn't think there was enough contrast between all of the colors so that's why I decided to add the blue. But this is my new soap called Focus. Is it focused? I hope it's focused. Daisy Dream Girl. Thank you guys for watching. I will show you a cutting video tomorrow.